Welcome back, Marquette. I'm Allie with the top 10 Disney Channel shows from our childhood. Number 10, Phil of the Future. This show's title says everything you need to know about it. Phil and his family are from the future, and they have to navigate the mysterious world of the present day. It was a short-lived show with some good laughs. Number nine, The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. This show was popular towards the end of what many of us consider to be our Disney Channel childhood. While it's not quite old enough to be a classic, we can at least appreciate that twin stars Cole and Dylan Sprouse avoided the curse of child stardom and both appear to be well-adjusted adults. Number eight, The Proud Family. This cartoon had everything, diversity, shenanigans, a poodle. Most importantly, it had a complete family with no orphans or widows, which we know is a rare f in Disney animation. Double points for including a sassy grandma. Number seven, Dave the Barbarian. If Disney Channel had any cult classics, this would definitely be one of them. This show was one of the most bizarre things the channel aired. It takes place in a fantasy version of the Middle Ages and has some truly hilarious characters, including the main antagonist, the Dark Lord Chuckles, the silly piggy. Number six, Hercules the Animated Series. Disney has turned a lot of their films into animated series, but none captures the same feeling of the film as Hercules. The animated series is filled with clever references to Greek mythology and stays true to the flamboyant characters we love, like God of the Underworld, Hades. Number five, Even Stevens. Before Shia LaBeouf was annoying the real world with his insane antics, he was being the troublemaker of his fictional family in Even Stevens. Viewers loved seeing what mischief the character got up to if his plots would be foiled by his fictional sis played by Christy Carlson Romano. Number four, That's So Raven. Before Raven Simone played a middle-aged woman on The View, she played a teen psychic. Her character was full of quotable catchphrases and always found herself in outrageous situations. Number three, Kim Possible. This animated action hero is the definition of cool. She had great friends, an awesome job, a hip outfit, high-tech gadgets, a brilliant family, and breezed through high school. It didn't matter if of your gender, everyone wanted to be Kim Possible. Number two, Recess. Although this show primarily aired on Disney-owned ABC, it's still technically a Disney show and deserves a spot on this list. Recess captured the essence of childhood and friendship and served as a basis for what every kid wished their school was like. Not only did it have great episodes, but also some exciting straight-to-video movies. And number one, Lizzie McGuire. A lot of this show's fan base is, of course, females, but it is a great show. Not only does it have Hilary Duff, animation, and middle school shenanigans, but a great movie that teaches you a thing or two about Italy. Well, that's all I have for you tonight.